It's our job in Congress to try to get the public policies right. And we have done some things right, uh, but we've also got some policies on the books that hinder progress. Uh, we need more certainty, we need more stability uh, in terms of energy tax credits, and frankly, we need legislation on climate change uh, that will help set the way going forward. What is one thing you would want to see from policymakers to support uh, renewable energy and energy efficiency? I think one of the biggest problems that we do have is that technology is running way ahead of code. And as a result of that, a lot of technology is being held back and a lot of the basically innovation to make zero energy, low energy, efficient homes is really being held up. Delving into that would be a big help. So of course as a university, one of our biggest uh, the challenges is research funding. I think whatever whatever is done, if there's a more kind of consistent long-term policies uh, in place, that would help our, uh, our our business. Just attention to geothermal, and there's a an array of geothermal bills that are in the that have been introduced into the Senate, and advancing those uh, it would help build bring geothermal power online, which would bring a lot of green jobs. A greater interest in in energy efficiency and new products that could come out that. Kind Congress could help with manufacturing within our country and more U.S. based products that may be through some subsidies or federal tax credits that would allow these companies to offer a U.S. based product. More of an emphasis on um, helping lower income communities access clean energy. Congress can support the renewable fuel standards, specifically the advanced biofuel portion. Um, that would be great for our industry. Well, I think that uh, Congress plays a role in creating incentives. I think some of the obstacles are in finance, so how can we create vehicles or incentives, incentives to uh, drive uh, deep energy retrofits? We'd like lawmakers to think a little bit more about what can be done to stimulate energy efficiency through the federal code uh, at these large uh, organizations like colleges and hospitals. If we package energy efficiency and renewable energy as a jobs bill, we advance our country forward, we advance the world forward, reduce our impact on the environment, we're creating more jobs so we have a better place for people, and we're going to be saving a lot of money and we're going to be making money in the process.